Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Alright, so I got a Kiki K haul today and the link for that is down below in the comments. And I promised in that haul video that I would do a flip through of the new slow collection from Kiki K because I purchased the sticker book and also the paper lovers book. Now if you haven't seen the previous video, I mentioned in there that I am so excited that Kiki K has finally gone back to their cute stuff. They haven't released anything that I've liked in nearly two years now, so I'm really, really excited that they've finally gone back to the stuff that made me fall in love with them in the first place. So exciting. Alright, so let's have a look. So we've got all these gorgeous artwork on the front. I'm loving the little foxes and the strawberries and the blueberries and the purity flowers. Oh, I just love it all. Ooh, now this is the first time I've opened this. I'm doing it with you so that we get to see it together for the first time. Now we've got some rose gold foiling. Wow, that is so pretty. All right, and I like this sticker, so it says be kind. I'm just going to pop that there. Be kind with the little bees. Smile, breathe, and go slowly. Don't worry, don't hurry, slow down. Disconnect to reconnect, make every moment count, and discover the beauty in simplicity. Now, if there has ever been a sticker book that is more perfect for 2020, then this is it. <laughs> All right, so next page we've got You First, Then the World, Love the Little Things, XOXO, Slow Down and Everything You Are Chasing Will Come Around and Catch You. I like that one. Live simply, hugs, kisses, and thanks. So I like that we've gone back to the older style um, shaped stickers as well. Love that. And then we've got a page full of all deco stickers. Oh, wow. I, I really hope that they do a washi matching this. I mean, could you imagine? Even if they don't, I have plenty of washies in my drawer that will match. I can't wait to make a planner spread with these. But look at all the fun, pretty artwork. I mean... It's just so pretty. We've got picnic baskets, a thermos, a cup of coffee or tea. You've got your butterflies, your bugs, your leaves, your animals. So, so cute. And that is exactly what I used to love about Kiki K. So I'm just thrilled that they've finally gone back to this. And then we've got our page full of beautiful flower stickers. Really lovely colours in that as well. And then on these we've got some more gold foiling. <laughs> like these so I think I'm falling for you with the full leaves time to porty pause some bunny loves you happy bee day happy birthday plant lady don't really know when I would ever use that <laughs> but okay um party time have a very very birthday wild and free and happy birthday so lots of that rose gold foiling then we've got our gift labels. I love using these. So we've got our twos and our froms. They are perfect for labeling your gifts. And I always use these ones here, the smaller ones, for on the back of my cards, like those. And then we've got your round stickers, and you can use these as envelope seals or even gift seals or just to decorate a card or just however you want. They are just perfect. So, so pretty. I really, really love this lilac color. Please, Kiki K, if you're by any chance, by some small chance, watching this review, please get a planner in this color. That would be just so pretty. <laughs> I know they're not watching, but hey, you never know. Ooh, now these ones are unusual because we've got them on a black background. That really does take me out of my comfort zone, but I'm sure I can find a way to make them work. Hmm. Then we've got your gift tags. I like these. They're much thicker. They're on a card stock. And they've just got the little perforated hole that you just push out so you can thread your um, gift wrapping ribbons through. And then we've got some more gift tags. And these are more in your gift tags uh, shape. And I like that we've got all sorts of little sayings on them. So we've got things like thank you, happy birthday and with love. And then on this side, we've got some that say hip hop hooray for you and happy birthday. And then also a few blank ones. So if you don't necessarily want it to have a saying on there, then that's perfect. All right. So that's the end of the sticker book. Really happy with that one. 
And then the Paper Lovers book. Love these. I have so many Paper Lovers books and I love using them. I'm always getting them out and finding things to use. I often use the papers in these to make dividers for my planner. I laminate them and they just look so pretty. Or I use them to make envelopes or cards. Just about anything. Alright. So, adopt the pace of nature. Her secret is patience. Loving this design. Wow. Aren't the pretty pastel colours just adorable? Can you imagine if they brought out a range of planners in these colours? Oh my goodness, that'd be gorgeous. And I mean just a solid colour, like the lilacs and then the pinks and an aqua. I think they had an aqua recently because I've got an aqua one sitting here. All right, now I'm just going to flip through without talking too much on some, unless something really draws my attention more than usual. But I can assure you that I am just love, love, loving this book. And I am so thrilled that I decided to buy it. On a side note, I did notice that they've also now got a version 2 of the Ultimate Gift Wrapping book. Now, I haven't bought that one yet, but I think I might just need to. I just wanted to wait and see what collections they had in there. So I'm waiting to see a flip through of that before I decide to purchase that. I love these little mini envelopes. So they're already perforated. So you just push them out and then you can fold them up and make little envelopes. I love those. My kids like it when I give them those. And we've got the little cards. They're almost like mini postcards. And then here you've got your normal size card. You just... Follow the perforated line and then fold them in half here. I like that it's already scored so that you just fold it and it's easy done. I'm just going to move this book over a bit because I don't want to bend it too much because everything will come out. <laughs> Alright, so we've got some more mini cards here and then some really mini cards. Okay, then we've got some stickers here. We've got some washi strips and some of your corner stickers that Kiki K used to be known for. Used to love those. We've got some of the round stickers again, so more of those. And in today's rush, we all think too much, seek too much, want too much, and forget about the joy of just being. That is so true. If you see an opportunity for joy, take it. Look at all these pretty gift tags. Wow. I've got a, bit, a friend's birthday coming up in mid-December, so she is going to be one of the first to get something pretty from this book. You know who you are out there. <laughs> She's also a fellow Kiki K addict, so I know that she'll actually really appreciate it too. <gasps> Look at these bows. So these are little bows. If you haven't seen these before, there's three parts to the bow. There's the back of the bow. The um, No, sorry, that's the actual bow you fold it up. Then this is the backing of the bow, and this is the little piece of paper that you wrap around once you've folded it up to make the bow. And then you just stick them onto your presents, and they look adorable. Then we've got a bookmark here, paper tassels, that's a new one, I'm not sure what I'll use that for, but I could use it to decorate my craft room, I guess, they're coming out a bit. A paper rosette, hang on, I don't want to get the tassels stuck and folded, oh man, no matter what I do, they're going to fold, oh well. Okay, so then we've got some more stickers, um, your gift labels. And again, we've got everything from with love to blank ones, lots of love, happy birthday, and kisses. So I like that they give you a good variety. And I love that they always put in the blank ones. That's so cool. We've got some more of these deco stickers too. Look at that, a whole page. And they're a little bit bigger, I think, than the ones that were in the sticker book. I'm just having a look. Yep, yeah, they are just a tiniest bit not much oh then we've got a strawberry treat box i always like that they include the little gift boxes that you can make and there's instructions at the bottom if you're not sure how to make them but they are really easy to make i've never had a problem making them another gift box we've got some gift tags some long ones and we've got some bigger style cards they're nice and then we've got some of the papers again. Look at that. And we've got another mini envelope. I really like that one. This background colour, I was just thinking, could you imagine that in a planner? Oh, wow. 
I love pinks. That would be so pretty. Another mini envelope. Oh, and then we've got some lined papers as well with Be Kind on there with lots of bees. Take it off line with the foxes. Love the little things. One thing at a time. And now we go into our gift tag section. So we've got some different shaped gift tags. And again, with the little hole that you just push through. We've got some more cards. You're so sweet and hip hip hooray. Or hip hop hooray, sorry. We've got some more of the larger size postcards. We've got a paper rosette. Some more paper bows. So pretty. A paper fan and it says this is part one and here's part two that's interesting another gift box these are very handy when you're giving gifts and the little ones like this are really handy for if you're giving things like little earrings or um, bracelets necklaces things like that and we've got our alphabet stickers I do enjoy using those especially for decorating envelopes or inside birthday cards We've got some more round stickers there. And then we've got some more deco stickers, the floral ones that we saw in the sticker book. But again, they're slightly larger. And then we've got some more stickers here with some sayings on them. I like this saying, nature does not hurry, yet everything is accomplished. Which is true. Why do we rush around like headless chooks? <laughs> All right, some more little cards, postcards. These are fun to use at the moment to send to people just to say, hey, I'm thinking of you, which is something that we all need at the moment. And it just doesn't take too long to pop that in the mailbox and send it to your friends or your family just to let people know that you're thinking of them. Because I think this year now than ever, it's something we really need to do just to let everyone know that we're thinking of them. Okay, so we've got another gift box. This one's on really thick card. And now our gift wraps. I always love these. So let's have a look here. This one's got your florals on the yellow background. And on the other side, it's got the pink with the bugs and the leaves and the flowers. So very cute. And the next one is on the white background with the all the stickers that we've seen. And we'll just go this way and see what we've got on the back. Oh, we've got the little bees on the back. It's very cute. Alrighty. So that was the Paper Lovers book. Now this one in Australia retails for $29.99. And the sticker book um, from memory, don't quote me, may have been $19.99. Um, now I purchased these during the sale. And like I said, I think I got 30% off from memory. I thought it was a great deal. If you're... Um, thinking of purchasing, make sure that you check out the Black Friday sales that are coming up. Um, I think that it may already have started at Kiki K, so just have a look for that. But if you've enjoyed this flip through of the new Paper Lovers book and the stickers book in the slow collection, make sure that you give my video a thumbs up so that I know you're enjoying these videos. And leave a comment below and let me know what you think of the new collection that Kiki K has released. Do you love it as much as I do or have you enjoyed the things that they've had out in the last couple of years that I didn't like so much? It's funny, we all like different things and that's okay. Alright, and lastly, make sure you're following me over on my Instagram, which is Stationary Happiness with a dot in the middle, and you'll get to see all my beautiful um, creations in my planner, as well as Happy Mail unboxings and crafting that I do as well. I look forward to chatting to you again soon, everyone. Bye-bye.